Hello and welcome to the Dope Academy podcast. My name is Mona, of course, and I am joined today by D-Lo 1200. What's up, y'all? What's up with it? You're going to find out more about him, learn all the good stuff, whatever. Hope everybody had a great week. Um, happy Easter to all y'all observing, the ones who weren't and just chilled. Happy day to you as well. So, D-Lo. What's up? What's up? What's, <laughs> What's up? What's good? What's up with it? So, I wanted to have you come on because I heard some of your music. You were actually um, in the comments on another podcast episode I had with Interstate Snake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And when he vouched for you, I was like, oh, I got to pay attention because, yeah. you know what I'm saying? My man know music. Just like, I know music. I'm a yeah, music lover. Yeah, yeah. So, I checked your music out. I liked it. And I wanted to get you here because you're a DMV artist. I try to support, you know, everybody in our area. And just kind of... Find out more about you so that the audience can find out more about you as well. Yeah, thank you. This is a good platform, too. I love it. So, <laughs> so welcome. We're going to get into it. And then we're going to get into some like regular uh, hip-hop talk and all kinds yeah, of stuff yeah, like yeah. that, too. <clears throat> thank you for everybody who's out there watching. If you um, haven't liked or subscribed to the Dope Dichotomy pages on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, all your major streaming platforms, Spotify, all that stuff, please do that tonight. Thank you, period. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. So tell everybody about yourself. Like, who is D Lo 1200? Look, man, D Lo 1200, for real, for real. Like, he come from Alexandria, you know what I'm saying? For real, for real. A DMV baby that know every ins, outs, and all of the world, you know what I'm saying? But I tell my own flavor by my own sauce the way how I do it. You know what I'm saying? That's about it. That's the only thing I can tell you. You gotta listen to my music, you know what I'm saying? If you don't, if nothing don't go over your head, you know what I'm saying? You <laughs> understand, you know what I'm saying? But. You know what I'm saying? I, I put out good music for a reason. You know what I'm saying? And it's in my way. You know what I'm saying? So just go ahead and ride with the wave. You know what I'm saying? If anything, you know what I'm saying? We're going to play something. You know what I'm saying? And uh, something that's not even dropped. I don't even know if we're going to play. I don't know. Oh. But we're going to see. You know oh, which one's not dropped? Uh, I got 10. Oh, the, okay. Then we can yeah. play that one at the end. And we can play Work yeah. It. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that yeah. one ain't even dropped yet. Eric, can you hear us? Yes. I, it's weird because I don't hear myself. So <laughs> for some reason tonight, I feel like um, I'm yeah, used to hearing it. Okay, I just want to make sure. Sorry, I wanted to make sure we was getting this all, you know, correct. Oh, wow, so you're from Alexandria. Yeah. We're out in Alexandria. Uh, honestly, I'm from the other side of Delray. I'm from basically like uptown Delray Park. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's called Yates Corner now, type. You. But that's where I'm from. But all of my family from the projects, shout out to the projects. That's what the OGs, they 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 blessed me with the name 1200. You know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? I just ran with it. You know what I'm saying? People, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's Absolutely. why the music's so aggressive. You get what I'm saying? That's why I'm taking it and run with it. You know what I'm saying? So, that's, another, that's another day, another story. Cheetah Loves K yeah. says, hey, let's go. Hey. Thank you for tuning in. You know it. You thank know, you very you know, much. That's my baby, you know what I'm saying? Yes, thank you for tuning in, baby. Yeah. Um, so on your song that I really, really fucks with, which is work, you say that you went to Woodbridge. Yeah. That's where I'm I'm from, born and raised. Yeah. So did you like live in Woodbridge at some point? Yeah, I did live in Woodbridge. The story behind that is I had a big buck knife. I went to Moore Elementary. <laughs> I, like <laughs> And for real, I was going to get somebody. Like, for yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, third grade, right? Yeah. yeah. Honestly, I, I was lying. I was lying. I, I, I lied. It wasn't third grade. It was actually first. Third mm. grade sound good with the line, but it was actually first grade. Wow. You know what I'm saying? It was actually first grade. And uh, I had a buck knife or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But, like, I'm the person who, like, like me, like, I'm the person who bullied the bully. Like, mm -hmm. that's why my mutual aggressive. Like, I bully the bully. Like, if you want to go ahead and challenge me, go ahead. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I got your back. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> and that's what it was. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he was a real, he was a real bully. But it turns out, right, he was my god brother. But I you was, ain't know that at the time. I did not know that. Shit. Okay. I, I ain't know none of that shit. Yeah. yeah so he was a bully. Right. Was he bullying somebody else or trying to bully you? Man, it's not. He was trying to bully my friends. Yeah. So you went ahead and was yeah. about to come through. Okay. Yeah, I was about to come through, and I and I showed it to the wrong person. You know oh what I'm saying? man. I, show, I showed I showed the knife to the wrong person at the end of the day. I was about to leave for the bus or whatnot, and the principal just grabbed me. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm trying to break loose. Like, like how the fuck do you even know I got the <laughs> knife in my... Yeah, I got caught, though. Yeah, I got caught. Yeah, but it's a good thing. Yeah, yeah, I That could have changed the trajectory yeah, 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 of your yeah, life. Yeah, like, yeah I'm hmm. already here, but then after that, of course, I got put out of Alexandria, so I had to move to a bridge, so... Oh, okay, yeah. okay. 
Apple Bridge, you know. And then you also have ties to DC yeah, as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. Of course, yeah, of course. Yeah, that's my my family out DC. Like all my cousins, my mama, everybody, everybody out DC. Like mm-hmm. everybody, everybody out DC. You know, I ain't never go to school out there. Mm-hmm. But like, like with me, you like spent so much time. Yeah, like school was so jumpy in my life for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? So I basically like spent my life like, like out Woodbridge. That's where you make money at. For mm-hmm. real, for real. Like, let's get real. You mm-hmm. make money out Woodbridge, then you slide out. You know what I'm saying? That's what I did. After school, I slid out. After I did what I did, I slid out. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? Like, it was always like that. You know what I'm saying? And then, like, you know, people don't even, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's got to carry yourself a certain way. You get what I'm saying? That's how you survive long. You know what I'm saying? I feel you. Thanks for tuning in, Christine, in the comments. Christine Smith. So, <clears throat> one of the interesting things about you is that you've been, you've went viral before. Yeah. Okay. And you went viral with not just any old thing, but two huge superstars, especially in the hip hop black community. Right. Cardi B and Offset. Right, right, right. So tell me what happened with that. All right. So uh, I'm gonna keep it funky with you, right? <laughs> so, so look, so like me, like like it's my first time in Cali. Like I'm not focused on nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like I came out there to record a song and enjoy my birthday for for and i forgot it was my birthday the next day i ain't gonna hold you you know what i'm saying so but we went out we was on uh, rodeo i think that's where it's at don't give me if i'm wrong you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. but we was on rodeo or whatnot we walking down or whatnot you know what i'm saying we see the security guards or whatnot but in the, in the paparazzi i never seen paparazzi before but they waiting in front of the louis v store yeah so i'm stepping in front of everybody like hey you know what i'm saying like shit, <laughs> doing the most yeah like who y'all waiting on you know what i'm saying they like they say Cardi B and no. Matter of fact, I'ma back up. No, they wasn't even trying to tell me. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I walked over and I said, man, who in there? They was like Cardi B and Offset. They upstairs. I'm like, man, ain't no Cardi B and Offset. Like I'm from the DMV. Don't nobody come out here. <laughs> if somebody come out here, they probably do come out here. But you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But I'm like, nah, in man, California, you see people. All the time. Yeah, but man, how am I supposed to know? Yeah. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, so I'm like, so they like Cardi B up there. So I'm like, all right, yeah, whatever. So we soon as when we about to step off, right, man. I'm like, nah, I ain't about to step up. I'm about to go ahead to the side door because they celebrities. They're going to try to go down the elevator or something mm-hmm. like that. So whole time, they entourage. Some of them came down the steps. But once as they came down the steps, I seen Cardi B all set. Man, when I seen the goddamn paparazzi, they're like, phew. Boy, I'm like, I'm like, bro, what they running for? They and then not- they attack them. Yeah, and they, mm-hmm. they, they just take a picture. I'm like, bro, I ain't no geek in that snack. You know what I'm saying? You like, fanned out. It's like, like you fanned out. Like, Go ahead. Hold on, hold on, Keep hold on, it going. Hold on, but listen, though. But yeah, but, that, but like, look. <laughs> but the whole thing, I'm sitting there like, I ain't come to Cali for no reason, bro. It's some reason why this shit happened. Mm-hmm. Like, for real, bro. So I act like I, that wasn't offset. I said, set. Man, that ain't no offset. Hey, <laughs> no, set, that's you. Hey, hey, nigga, don't get in the car, be you? <laughs> so the whole time, he turned around and looked at me like, like, nigga, what you mean? I'm like, man, Seth, man, what's good? Come holler at me, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. fooling the whole time. Like, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? I know that. I know that. Being I, real I, animated. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So I walked over, like, everybody, his big ass security car right there. And what up? So I ended up dapping him up. You know what I'm saying? What's good? Hi, Cardi. Cardi, she was in the car. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. She said, hey, hey, back up. So I'm like, shit, you know what I'm like, oh, <laughs> shit. Like, this really happening. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, man, that ain't you. So the whole time I said, I, I tried to put it on her type shit. So all said he put down his mask and he said shit and put up and, and, mm-hmm. and they stepped off or whatnot. So that's when I stepped off or whatnot. So uh so like the paparazzi or whatnot, they're like, dude, dude, <laughs> Carter be an offset knows you, man. I said, bro, they don't know me, bro. <laughs> yes, they do. I'm like, so who started calling you a bully for bullying him into giving you a handshake? Man, look, man, everybody in DMV, bro, man, y'all, man, stop playing, bro. All right, bro, like, like they I, were mad. Listen, yeah, because they like, cause you know how like out here, like, you know what I'm saying, like, hey, you know what I'm saying, the way how we carry yeah. ourselves, y'all like aggressive, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying, but it's like it wasn't aggressive or nothing like that. I would just try, try and be a genuine bro. <laughs> but after that though, I ain't gonna hold you. After I met them, you know what I'm saying, to be for real, he took time to really, cause. Bro, I ain't really had to do that. Yeah. And, and he could have relied, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So, you know what I'm saying? But by him doing that, like, I'm a I'm fan, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm a reliable fan. Like, I'm a reliable be listening to his music. Like, mm-hmm. I got this one song with uh, with Young Nudie. That's one of my favorite artists, too, with Young Nudie. Mm-hmm. It's called Cinco de Mayo, bro. Check that joint out. That joint. Crank. I play that joint on repeat. My son go to sleep for <laughs> that song. Like, yeah. So did it make your social media blow up? Yeah, man. Like that's what I'm saying. In my demo, whatnot. Like people, like, like, dude, like, 
Like, why didn't you rap for him? Like, I'm like, bro, like, I'm not on that type of And sometimes you don't, in the moment, you don't yeah. think exactly, I got to do things this yeah, way, that way. No, nah, but I'm, I'm thinking about that. Like, you got to think about it. If I'm outside and I'm sitting outside, like, you got to think about it. Like, I'm thinking about, like, shit, what should I do? Like, should I rap? Man, hell no, I ain't no corny ass nigga like that, bro. Like, I'm not going to go out like that, bro, because that don't go too far. It's 2021. They don't go too far. So shit, I'm gonna just go ahead and man, let me just go ahead and say something like shit. Fuck but it. sometimes I think we overthink it because if you're dope and somebody hear you, it's gonna make them stop. I mean, yeah. I, I mean, know that I think people don't do that because a lot of people are whack and they do it yeah, and it don't go good. I mean, yeah, I just, I just been sitting around and I be sitting there looking at that and I'm just sitting there like, bro, like, I know, I know for a fact, like, I know for a fact, like, I'm gonna run into them again. Like, mm -hmm. I know for a fact, like, I'm, I'm, a, I'm gonna run into them. Speak too. it into existence. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I know it. Like, I know I, that's, that's And it'll be a dope ass story. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Once you get to a certain place. And but that's you what I'm saying. Again, if you really, you, if know? you really know my story, you get what I'm saying? It's a mm -hmm. lot of, I spent, I spent around like a whole bunch of people twice. You know what I'm saying? Just like, like, just like I told you how I met Snake. I didn't know Snake for being who Snake was mm -hmm. until. You hear what I'm saying? And that's G as shit for a nigga not to tell you, like, hey, bro, look, I do music. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Or I'm this. You know what I'm saying? Like, you really have found who the person is off the strength. You mm -hmm. hear what I'm saying? Like, and that's how, like, that's how I move. Like, you know what I'm saying? You find out who a person is off the strength. You dap me up if I'm cool enough or whatnot. Woo woo. Or we see each other. And, you know what I'm saying? Like, just imagine if I would have did that or whatnot. And I was some shit. And I still see him again. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Nah. I feel you. Nah. So, how would you describe your music to to the audience? Uh, to be honest, my my music truthful. My music truthful is where I've been my feelings or whatnot. But the tunes are for y'all. You know what I'm saying? The tunes are for y'all, but it's where I've my like my feelings. Like it's where I've like stuff that I go through like every day. You get what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. I'm like I just like make fun of it. You know what I'm saying? To make y'all happy for for you know what I'm saying? Like, but I really have to go through a situation every day. You know what I'm saying? Like. Don't think like, you know what I'm saying? You probably look at my Instagram and think all oh, nice and dandy or whatnot. <clears throat> you got to rely on grind and put your feet to the floor for you to stay relevant and all. You got to, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's me though, man. Like, I grind. Like, I grind. What's your process though? Do you um, do more freestyle or do you write things down? Nah, nah, I write. I write. I write straight up. Do you I write all the time, or just yeah, you like go through moments where you don't nah, write at all, and then you get the hit with nah, it? No, no, no. I write all the time. Mm -hmm. Like with me, like music go through my brain all the time. Like even right now, I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna put you in the bar, put your show in the bar. <laughs> Please do. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm <laughs> don't trying. Don't like, needs to like, be there. Nah, I'm serious. Like like that. Like music running my mind. Like even like that. My son, he's starting to rap. My daughter, she rap. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I was gonna bring her. You know what I'm saying? But she's scared though. So I ain't about to. I ain't gonna force her. She's scared. Saying? Yeah. She'll yeah, get over that. Yeah. Yeah. That's dope that she raps. Yeah, too, she dope. Like that's what I'm saying. Like my daughter, man, her name KK Kitty. Like, like, man, I'm telling you, my daughter crank. How old is she? She just turned eight. All right. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's she, dope. she been doing this, and like what I'm saying, like, and we talking about freestyle. No, you she, gotta send me some she, of her stuff. Man, I want to hear about she, that eight year old rapper. I'm telling yeah, you, man. Like, I'm I love telling that. you, you talking about freestyle. I'm telling you, you could put on a whole YouTube playlist, and she will go the whole playlist. Like you would have to tell her to be quiet, and nothing would sound the same. That's what's up. Yeah, I'm telling you, like my daughter crank, man, my daughter crank. Cheetah said, "Telling your story, real life." Yeah. I guess that's how she's describing your music yeah. as well. Yeah. So, do you feel like it's influenced more so from like old school hip hop or no? Nah, it's, it's more old, what's going way on now. Old school, it's, it's straight old school. It's, it's not even old school hip hop to be for real. It's like you got to think about. It. I'm born in '93. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So I heard everything from what they generation mm -hmm. is, my generation, my daddy generation. You get what I'm saying? And most of my music come from that. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That generation, you get what I'm saying? But then I still got the chop and screw. I still got the, you get what I'm saying? We still got the big T era. We still got the swag era. It's like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And then we still got this right here still going on. I'm still young. You get what I'm saying? And it's still changing. So who you know would you saying? say your musical influences are? Uh, To be for real, one is Paul Wall. Okay, I'm going oh, to keep it all the way gangsta. It's Paul Wall, Gucci, uh, OJ the Juice Man, of course. Mm -hmm. Uh, 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 Fred the Godson. Okay. Uh, who else? Uh, like I said, I got old school. I got old school people. You know what I'm saying? I got Kim. I got, I got Temptations. I got every everybody under everybody under my belt for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I said, I take everybody and I use it. I use it my way. And then what? With this era of music right here, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Like I'm listening. It's not necessarily listening to their words. I'm listening to their words or whatnot. But like, 
like it's their cadence. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. It's their cadence. I'm listening to their cadence, and I'm sitting here like, like I see how that is. You get what I'm saying? But I write faster, but how? You know what I'm saying? Like basically, that you know what I'm saying? I, I clap stuff together. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? But I don't use it. You know that's the one thing I don't use it. You know what I'm saying? I try it. You get what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I try it. You know what I'm saying? That yeah, but they're poetry styles. You should. Yeah. I, I, mean, I write poetry, and people always say the Migos they don't be doing nothing but jibber jabber. But yeah. they actually brought like the triplet form of poetry to yeah. hip hop. And that and maybe they weren't the first to do it, but they really have mastered doing that, and it created everybody to follow yeah. suit. You know how it goes. And, and but that's that's what I'm saying. I and think that's dope to study different cadences. Yeah, and that's what I mean, like. That's why I'm saying so. That's why I like that's why I like my flow is like it's like that. Like I used to listen to a whole lot of Twister, that, that too. Mm-hmm. You get what I'm saying? I used to listen to a whole bunch of that. You know what I'm saying? But then of course you listen to Wayne, then you listen to Gucci, then you listen. You know what I'm saying? I had a whole. So pretty then, much just everybody. Yeah, and, but then my but then my favorite my favorite type of music is jazz though. I ain't gonna hold you. Okay, let's yeah. get into it in a sentimental mood. Yeah, yeah, like what? I like I like I listen to, I listen to coffee jazz. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I listen to smooth. I listen sometimes I sometimes I listen listen to R and B, but I like I love coffee though. You like I coffee? Love, jazz? You yeah, like smooth jazz all yeah, stars? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They be yeah, getting this yeah, shit that's what off. I'm like, and I'm yeah. telling you, I sit there and I I I, I live stream it on, on YouTube. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? And nah, I, jazz is dope. I fuck with jazz. Yeah. All got old school new jazz. Everything. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like that's the blues cool. is dope too. I wish more people, more people who are um, coming up in hip hop. Tapping the blues because I feel like it hasn't been tapped into fully and it yeah. can really, really influence. And whenever a song has it in there, it's like it really yeah, hits. It hit heavy. It, yeah. hit, it hit way more heavier. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Because it's those it's those different pockets that they use that you can go. And that's what I'm saying. Like, but people don't know that it's artists out this junk right now that's just rapping or whatnot. You say an artist's name, they don't even know what it where it came from. They don't know where their shoes came from, the style came from, where the hat came from. You don't know where nothing came from. Mm-hmm. Half of these kids don't even know what little who Lil Wayne is. That's crazy. Like, but yeah. You know what I'm saying? But that's why I, I chill back. That's why I ride my own wave. Like me, I'm the vibe. I'm telling you. Yeah, I'm trying to like, when I was hearing your music, I was trying to figure out like, who are you? But I do feel like you have a very good mix of yeah. everything. And we're going to get into it. Um, Eric, can you play... Was it work it? Yeah, you play work. Work. Yeah, this is my favorite song too. This is my favorite song. I didn't know it was his favorite song, but I told him, and he was like, "Oh, that's my shit too." Man, <laughs> I'm telling you, that's that's the repeat song right there. Y'all. And you got my hometown in it. Yeah, you know I'm saying. I, so I was like, I "Oh know. shit!" I know. Yeah, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Yes, that's my favorite. That's my baby right there. And I really rocks with that joint. Thank you so much, man. So, audience, if you're fucking with the song when you hear it, make sure you say it in the comments. I know it's Easter Sunday, so everybody's like, eh. yeah. but give me a little energy. Man, y'all better. I was low, you nigga, it got caught. Don't, 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 don't. Yeah. Throw me in the house, nigga. Go, 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 go. Do a pig, you be so dope. Walking with you, do what you be so dope. I'll get not to lift, you be so dope. Let your hit it now, you be long, long. I was low, you nigga, it got called off. I say, fuck him now, knock it so long. Jerome in the house, take his gold off. Send a cast pick, you get hold off. Send a duke a pig, you be so dope. Walking with your kids, you be crawled off. Talking not your lip, you be no dope. Bet you get it now, you be long lost. Third grade almost killed a nigga. Kicking me out, told me take a picture. Went to Woodbridge and start hanging niggas. With a DC and start painting a picture. With my first folk while I'm in the kitchen. Mama told me stop, this is how you with me. Then I ran it up and got my first ticket. Stop stealing from me, they ain't never get it. Got caught slipping by my own brother. I was laid up, fucking on the cover. Wasn't dogged up today, was no other stick. Whooping nigga like I'm cooking butter. Clip a sandwich while she catching up. Got the torch, watching these buckle. Walking with the work, we gon' watch and fumble. Clip crush a nigga like I'm burning funnel. Stuff a nigga like a trap tunnel. Pop a nigga like a money bundle with the summer. Nigga, then we gotta rumble. Don't call me up, you got your bitch in trouble. Since you love a nigga, come and join the struggle. Mush mouth, we gon' make a mumble. Ain't bullets, but I bet I nudge you. When I roll the dice, she come and join the jungle. I was low, you nigga, it got called off. I say, fuck him now, knock it so long. Jerome in the house, take his gold off. Send a cast pick, you get hauled off. Send a duke a pick, you get sawed off. Walking with your kids, you get crawled off. Talking out your lips, you be gnawed off. Let you get in you be long lost. Third grade, almost killed a nigga. Kicking me out, told me take a picture. Went to Woodbridge and start hanging niggas. With a DC and Stop paint a picture with my first folk while I'm in the kitchen. Mama told me stop, this is how you whip. Then I ran it up and got my first ticket. Stop stealing from me, they ain't never get. I'm a leader of 30, a homie is sporty, a bitch is shorty. Get hit with the 40, I'm ballin' like Cordy, and stitchin' in Cordy, and bullets keep ported. He run out his Jordy. Fresh shit on the neck, and the shit that's important. Smoke us a weed to see in the morning. I beat your ass up by the camera corner, drinking the 40, and telling the story. Blow you nigga, it got called. 
room in the house, take your gold off. Yeah, dog, yeah, dog, yeah, dog, yeah, dog. Yeah, pick, you be saw dog. Yeah, Walking yeah, with you, do what you be call dog. Yeah, Talking yeah, not to lick, you be all dog. Yeah, Let y'all get it now, you be long lost. Uh, long, Third grade long, almost killed me. Kill 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 uh, the wood bridges start hanging, uh, hanging, hanging, hanging. Uh, hanging uh, uh, first vote, why I'm in it? Uh, mama told me stop, this is how you do it. Your mama told me stop, this is how you do it. All right, so that's the song Work by D-Lo 1200. As you can see, that's why I'm fucking with it. That shit, that shit go. Your yes. flow, everything, that shit go. Right. And the words, I'm hearing that's it. I'm hearing that story, you know what I'm saying? Right, yeah. Um, so, how did you get started rapping? Uh, to be for real, like, I was tired of, like, I, like, I, was, good. I was good in football, right? Like, I was good as hell in football, you know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. of course, every athlete start with music. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody know, man, I was that man. You know what I'm saying? I got, I got a scholarship in lacrosse and all that. You know what I'm saying? So. Oh, wow. Yeah, but I ended up fucking it up. But, you know. <laughs> but, look, but, you know what I'm saying? I was tired of, I, I, I was listening to so many good beats. You know what I'm saying? Like, from a different artist. Not saying it was me. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I was tired of listening to their words. Like, I was tired of that shit. I'm like, bro, I, I know I can do something. Like, you know what I'm saying? And, like, I told you, my stepfather, like, he made music before, like, like, you know what I'm saying? I ain't know what none of that equipment was. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, it's him and his brothers. You know what I'm saying? Someone making the beats and they all just, and it's, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, like, one time, like, shout out K-Son TV. You know what I'm saying? K-Son TV. You know what I'm saying? Like, my man, he been cranking. He been doing his thing for a long ass time. You know what I'm saying? He do gaming or whatnot, vlogging on YouTube, following mm -hmm. him. But, you know what I'm saying? We end up uh, recording a song or whatnot. It's called Bait Money. You know what I'm saying? Like, Bait Money, like... That joint was so smooth, it would have like a Roscoe Dash feeling. You know okay. what I'm saying? It was mm -hmm. back in them, you know what I'm saying, with the jerk skinny mm -hmm. jeans. You know what I'm saying? Like we was like, we was like that, you know what I'm saying? But the joint went crazy. Like it played in the club, like all of that. Like at at that age, you get know what I'm saying? Like, like we cranking at that age, and I didn't really know, you know what I'm saying, how to like to put my words together, nothing like that. But I'm watching K Son do it, you know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. and Lil Wayne was his like his like his idol, you know what I'm saying? So I'm sitting there like, shit if if he like Lil Wayne, like, I got to figure out, like, and I listen to all different type of artists. Like, I'm listening to Cassidy, but, like, when I listen to New York music, I listen to Chopper Screw. You get mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, like it's always something with, yeah. with it. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm like, all right, bet. So, he finally showed me. So, boom. Like, I end up going, we end up going viral through the school. You know what I'm saying? So, finally, I end up recording music just a little bit, but then I forgot about music. I'm like, man, I don't know what that shit is. I don't know. You left like, alone. You was, like, doing yeah, sports? Yeah, I was doing sports. Okay. So, uh, so then after that or whatnot, you know what I'm saying? Like, I end up, uh, I end up, uh, what I do? I end up, uh, oh, I end up, like, I end up, uh, like, I was, like, I was jugging one time. Like, I was young. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. I used to walk around with, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And this one dude pulled up to me. He had tents. You know what I'm saying? And, like, I like one time I prayed in the shower. I'm like, I'm like, God, please send me somebody. Like, I just want to get signed and just get the oh, out of yeah, here. Yeah, away like, from please. it. Yeah. Bro, I promise you, two days later, I'm walking outside. Somebody in the tent car, he walked up to me. He's like, little bro, you know what some guy said? I'm like, yeah, bro, you know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? So I hopped in the car, so we start freestyling or whatnot. The whole time, I ain't even know. Shawty from Texas, he ain't even supposed to be out this junk for real. He chilling, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So the whole time, while we sitting there freestyling or whatnot, he see that I got whatever I got type shit. So whole time, his man, he from Louisiana, and he got a whole record label looking for people out here. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So whole time, I end up linking up with him or whatnot. Like, but, you know, it take time for, you know what I'm saying? They from a different, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. like, me and they older, y'all, like, you know what I'm saying? At that time, they was older. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, I'm like, shit, like, I got to thug it with them, you know what I'm saying? To show them that, you know what I'm saying? I'm me and how I'm, how, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? But they got money, though. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? And I'm still on the street. You know what I'm saying? And then I'm I got my, you know what I'm saying? I'm doing music. They taking me to these big ass houses. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm looking like an ant compared to those houses. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. But I'm sitting there, I'm robbing niggas and shit and, and doing that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like so now they looking at me like shit. You know what I'm saying? And I told you I ain't not messing with the girl on the label. You get what I'm saying? Oh, uh, like, he was a liability. Like you get what I'm saying? <laughs> like I ain't not messing with the girl on the label the first time I met her. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, but it wasn't my fault. She hopped on my motherfucking back and started yeah. doing that. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, but I ended up they ended up taking away my contract. But 
at that time, I'm shit. I'm like shit, man. I don't give a damn about that contract because you felt confident you could get yeah, another one. Yeah, like not, but not even that because I built that. We built that studio from the ground up, bust the walls down, everything. I was rocking with this dude for a whole two years, mm -hmm. a year before I even even can get signed. You get what I'm saying? So, uh, so, um, so he like, man, D-Lo, hey, man, you know what I'm saying? Like, we can't have that. Woo -woo. So basically, like, I pulled my drawers up. I'm like, so you want to know what? Well, let me get my contract, buddy. Mm -hmm. So he was like, nah, D-Lo, come on, man. Let's renegotiate your contract. You know what I'm saying? Mind you, I ain't never recording this junk. This nigga keeps saying, D-Lo right, D-Lo right, D-Lo right. Nigga, I've been writing my motherfucking ass off, bro. Mm -hmm. Like, God damn, let me just. But was he doing artist development with you? Man, Possibly. No, that's no. That's kind of how it goes sometimes. No, man, it wasn't no artist development, man. It, it was like he believed it. Like, I was the first one on the on the lineup you know what i'm saying mm -hmm. so he believed in me so much he just wanted me to keep keep going keep going keep going and then like i said like like i get around you know what i'm saying like one of shawty little ne nephews you get what i'm saying like he ended up linking up with me he was on the label too with me you get what i'm saying so he believed in me so he telling he like man come on bro like mm -hmm. let him get let him let him get loose mm -hmm. you know what i'm saying so he like man nah i'm gonna let him keep writing so guess what we did we snuck right to the studio and he had one built and built right in his house whole time I end up recording that joint. So the whole time I've been recording so many songs. Now we sending him a song. Now he mad. You yeah, know what I'm saying? He didn't follow you. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. Now he mad, but the whole time, like now, but like I already, I already signed the paper now. So now since I got the songs recorded, of course they not mine. You get what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. they not mine. So now I got to submit the songs now. So the songs literally, like, like, everybody know. Y'all know record labels. Y'all know when everybody y'all know if y'all was signed. It got to go through 100 people. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Damn near everybody, you know what I'm saying, for it to get clear. Ain't none of my songs get clear. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Why? Because it wasn't my time. You get what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So I was like, you want to know what, TD? Man, oh. So then you ended up getting with 1,200? Huh? Yeah, but that, yeah, that's what, see, hold on, that's what I'm saying. That came down the line. When I lost my contract, you know how bad they hit me. I bet no matter, you. no matter what, no matter what, what nobody say, like, you know what I'm saying? I could say I ain't care about none of that, and I could do, man, that hit me hard. Yeah. And then I'm still with my D4L partner, and he's still signed to him, too, so I'm sitting there like, fuck. What the fuck should I do now? Like, now I'm stuck, like. So what'd you do? I end up, like, for real, for real, like, I end up, like, just sitting back and changing my style, to be honest. Your, your your style, like, in general, yeah. or your, your flow? My flow, like, I, I sat back and changed my flow because, like, because, like, I was D-Lo with him. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That was the swaggy, aggy old. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like I feel like the music that he had, the music that I was putting out, that's what that's what people was going to go get. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I'm like, nah, bro, I ain't, I'm not about to do that. So basically, I took my time. Then I ended up taking probably like a year off. That's when I ended up moving back to Alexandria. The mm -hmm. first day I moved back to Alexandria, shot out my cousin. He already know what's going on. They was shooting, they was shooting a documentary. You know what I'm saying? He already knew I was fire. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So the whole time they shoot a documentary or whatnot. So the whole time during the whole documentary, he going through that crowd looking for everybody. But soon as when the jump starts, he said, shit, where my little cousin? Where my little cousin? You know what I'm saying? But like me, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm humble. Like, I'm, mm -hmm. I'm still chilling the cut. I ain't about to be like, hey, right here. Like, no, I ain't, with none, I ain't, I ain't no goofy ass nigga like that. So the whole time he ended up finding me the whole time, I ended up crushing that jump. When I say crush it, like, that's when everybody want to hang on a nigga. Like, yeah, that's my nigga, <laughs> D-Lo. Like, yeah. I'm like, man, I ain't with none of that. So, whole time, and I hear people, like, even when they like, man, he ain't from 1200. He ain't from 1200. No, I'm not from 1200. Mm -hmm. That's one thing I know I'm not from. I'm a, I'm a DMV baby, like, for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? It's no it's no hate or nothing like that on 1200 or nothing like that. You get what I'm saying? But I came and I put, and I was trying to put them on. Mm -hmm. You get what I'm saying? Because I already had a run before I even came and all did what, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to put them on without asking no questions. So you get with them, you 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 link up with them. How many people were, were man, in your shit, whole Man, thing? shit, it was damn near 30, 30 people. Like, the gang was so big, we, they had bookers the same day. We got to go one way, the other gang got to go this way. We're probably switched. That's the next a lot, hour. though. That's a lot of people. Yeah, it, a lot man, of moving it, parts. It, it, it was, you get what I'm saying? But at a, at a, at a time point, that shit was organized. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? That shit was real live, like, organized. Like, we really had that shit on. You know what I'm saying? And I took the back seat. And I'm still recording. You get what I'm saying? Then when I'm then while I'm recording, like, like no, we, we, we didn't sign no paper or nothing like that. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? But we all neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? Went to school together. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? That's how I know that we went to school. It's nothing friends or no nothing like that. It's just straight music. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? While I'm recording my music, you know what I'm saying? Like, they dropping my music. Well, I'm like, bro, I don't want it. I don't want it. You don't it. want it no. like that. Like, mm -hmm. I don't want it. You know what I'm saying? 
I don't want it like that with you. So I'm like, all right, you know what? Fuck it. So once I asked everybody, like the people who performing at the shows, like they they was doing they do. And I'm sitting in the back, so I'm sitting there like, shit, they drop my motherfucking music, so shit. Why the fuck not? I start booking my own shows. Mm-hmm. Shit, man. And I want to say, when I said start booking, man, I'm going, man. I went to Atlanta, nigga. I went to, I went everywhere, and everybody, they just sitting there. They was right there, just right there. Mm. Like, come on, dog. Like, nah, man. And y'all, what, and y'all shaming on me? Why y'all shaming on me? I'm, I'm putting y'all on. I'm doing whatever I got to do, and I'm, not, I'm not asking nobody. And, and I'm, I'm, I'm putting up, like, I'm putting up the best wordplay with these. With like shit, well, my niggas don't mix up. We shape and shape up niggas that I hate in my <laughs> basement taped up. You shoot like, like talk your shit, King. Like, like, okay. I'm just like, and I'm sitting there. I'm just like, you know what? Like, fuck it. But sometimes people are meant to be on your journey to take you to a certain point. They're not meant to go the full journey yeah, with you. Yeah. So all that stuff is in the plan. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You do wherever. So now you're doing more. You know the solo thing. Yeah, fully. yeah, yeah. yeah. And straight forward, do yeah. you want to drop a project like an album? Yeah, or? yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to, I want to drop, I want to drop an EP though. I want to drop an EP to just give y'all like. I think you should. Like you know what I'm saying? Like like you know what I'm saying? Like because all my music hard. Like all my music hard. If if I if I drop a good EP with with a, with a good amount, you'll pick a good amount to have the amount the one that you don't like. Okay. Mm-hmm. Like I'm telling you, like it's gonna be good. Like it's always gonna be good. So. In the in just the regular hip hop world, I'm gonna name some names, and it's gonna be either or, and you gotta pick. You don't have to say. um, Okay, well hold on. Yeah, this one is gonna be. If one gotta go. All right, bet. And they're not gonna be easy. All right, bet. Okay. Um. Lil Wayne, Jay Z. Jay Z. Uh, Money Bag Yo. Yo Gotti. Money bag yo. Gucci Mane, Jeezy. Gucci, duh. Gotta go? Yeah. No, no, no. Gotta go. Gotta, Jeezy gotta go. I'm sorry, <laughs> Jeezy gotta go. All right, Cardi B, Meg Thee Stallion. Fuck. Mm. I say Megan Thee Stallion. Why I say Megan Thee Stallion is because... Cardi B, I'm still fishy, baby. I'm sorry. I'm still fishy about you, your words. I think your man writing your shit. Okay? Ain't nothing wrong with it, okay? But Megan Jai, she just doing that. So, know? but I think you're picking wrong. Mm-hmm. You pick the one that has to go. So you're saying Megan has to go? No, no, I'm sorry. You're Cardi saying Cardi go. has to go? I'm sorry. Cardi gotta go. Sorry. I'm gonna need you to get the game together. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Cardi, I'm sorry. Cardi gotta go, though. All yeah. right, all yeah. right. Yeah. Um,. Pooh Shiesty, uh, uh, Lil Baby. Lil Baby gotta go. You don't like Lil Baby? Nah. I don't like that type of music. So Lil Baby don't go. Lil Baby gotta 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 go. I would say the same thing. I go. Freddie Gibbs, Royce the Five Nine. Man, Freddie Gibbs, straight up. Gotta go. Man, he gotta go. Okay. <laughs> he gotta go. Kanye West, Jay Z. Kanye West gotta go. Kanye West gotta go. Yeah, but think about all the production. Yeah, but you wanna know something? But Jay Z talked that real shit though. Yeah, I know, but I'm just thinking both of them is is hard because Jay Z has all the business things that the the blueprint for that, yeah. and Kanye has so much production. Yeah, but I I'm still I'm still on that side though. I'm doing that to get right there though. Yeah, you know that's true. So okay. I, okay, let's let's see if you answer correctly. Oh shit. Tupac or Biggie? Oh my god. I gotta say Biggie. I'm sorry. Yes. Okay. I just put my. This is yeah. a. This is a tattoo a quote yes. from Tupac. So I was like, I want to see if you answer correctly. Um. um let's see. Tupac always talk that shit. Yes. Wu Tang. Oh my. God. Or. Outcast. Ooh, that's so hard. I couldn't even do that one. Nah. See, Outcast. Outcast. That like. That's the vibe. So I'm Outcast. So Wu Tang gotta go. Yeah, Wu Tang gotta go. 
They yeah. gotta go. Because like ATL and uh what else what's that other joint? Uh Equimini. Southern playlist that have like funky music. That's my man, I'm mm-hmm. telling you, see that's what I'm saying. Like all that right there, like that's all I played that when I was a kid, back to back, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. On repeat on my little radio. Yeah. Um Paul Wall. Oh no. Pimp C. Oh no. <laughs> Paul Wall gotta go, man. But <laughs> you can't do that, man. My man, he be talking that shit, but Pimp C got it, though. Um, Pimp C got it. Bun B. Come on, man. That's fucked up. Or 8-Ball MJG. 8-Ball MJG gotta go. They gotta okay. go. We have some more music taste. All right. Ah, they gotta, let's they gotta see. Go. They gotta go. Kendrick Lamar oh. or J. Cole. Kendrick Lamar gotta go. I like them both. I won't even get mad. Nah, he it's gotta, gotta be. He gotta go. Kendrick is crazy with the wordplay. He is crazy with Trip the wordplay. Triple entendres? What? Yeah, I mean, yeah, he, he, he is good. But like I said, like, his vibe not, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want to kill myself. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't want that vibe. Like, <laughs> I'm good. Man. She said, why would you choose between Biggie and Tupac? Shaking my fucking head. <laughs> <laughs> you got to, though. That's the game. That's the game, though. You know? Nah. Nobody would really want to. Man, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm sorry, but... Twister or Bone Thugs and Harmony? Man, shit, man. I'm picking Twister off Bucks. I'm sorry. You're picking them, but Bone gotta go. Bone gotta go. Bone gotta go. They gotta... I, under... I, see, what... I see where you're trying to get at. <laughs> I see where you're trying to get at, okay? But mm-hmm. that's three against one, okay? So I, I take the one. I take the one because he can do all three. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's switch it up. Let's get into movies. And guess what? Whole mm-hmm. time, you already know. If you know music, you already know that album, Kamikaze. Mm-hmm. Yeah, okay. That's a dope album. Yeah. Yeah, no, I know. You can listen to it. I mean, I could also say East 1999 Eternal. Like, yeah, no. Yeah, so that's a classic album as well. You can, but still, like... But but I well I will say Twista pr- provided that blueprint yeah. for that you know I hands down you know people don't be wanting to yeah. give him his credit but he, yeah. he did that's it what I'm real. saying that's what I'm saying like I ain't, ain't nothing against Bone because that's what I grew up on you know what I'm saying I'm a '93 baby don't mm-hmm. get it fucked up okay Bone Thugs always going to come first but Twista like if he he can do all three so I ain't you mm-hmm. know what I'm saying then he's still doing his thing right now so yeah okay um. Oh, before movies, I want to do production. Oh. Dr. Dre or Pharrell? Pharrell. Got to go? No, he's staying. Okay, he's staying. make sure the one sorry, you pick is the one. Sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> For the third time. Sorry, okay, but Dr. Dre. See what happens when, when the guest and the host smokes before yeah, the, no the podcast? <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, Dr. Dre got to go, though. So you would keep Pharrell? Yeah, I keep Pharrell. On, I, I on Virginia keep, GP? Yeah, or okay, okay. Straight, just straight out the gate. Just yeah. straight out the gate. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, me and Pharrell, we could work with Dr. Dre. <laughs> Timberland or Pharrell? Timberland. Gotta go. Yeah, Timberland gotta go. Okay. That's not an easy one for me. Yeah. It depends on what type of music I want to do. Timberland gotta go. Like, he too animated for me. He is very animated. Yeah, he, too, he way too animated for me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I told you, like, Pharrell, like, that's what I'm saying, like, I got all the color turtlenecks. I wear turtleneck every day. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like even in the summer. Man, look, man, like, man, I'm telling you, man, I be in the house, so. You better start selling merch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, I, I was already thinking about turtleneck it. You know merch. What I'm yeah. yeah, I was already thinking about it. You know what I'm saying? But you, know. you should have a shirt. I thought I thought about when I heard that. Um, I'm gonna give you. I mean, this is this is for you. You ain't, you ain't gotta give me no money. Oh, all right. All that right. first that line in the chorus of work, where you say I was loyal, but. Uh, Mm-hmm. What, what do you say again? I said, I, w- I was loyal, nigga. Uh, what was, I would think I said, I, uh, I got called off. I said, I got, it got I was, called off. Yeah, it I should say, I was loyal, it got caught off. Yeah. Like, you should sell shirts to say yeah. that shit. Yeah, I was loyal, nigga. It got called yeah, off. That's yeah, what, that's, that's merch. Okay, yeah. Boys in the Hood, that was Minister a true Society. Story too. That was a true story. True. Matter of fact. You know what I'm saying? Boys in the Hood, Minister Society. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, no, we're going to get into it. Wait get a minute. It. Okay. All right, because my man Kane was doing it, okay? <laughs> but they came back with the quickness. But mm-hmm. I gotta take, I gotta take, I gotta take, I gotta take Minister Society. Why? It's because it's more gangster. 
So you're keeping Miss Society. I have to decipher each answer mm -hmm. you can give. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No. Boys I'm, in the Hood got to go. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm getting rid of Boys in the Hood because Boys in the Hood started off with a mama's boy. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, we good. I start with the grandparents. You know what I'm saying? Like, that was that's my life right uh -huh. there. You know what I'm saying? My grandma. You know what I'm saying? I love both those movies, but I think I would probably pick Miss Society. Cause yeah. it just has more Man, part, but but Boys in the Hood is a like, like give me your is a is a Rams. classic movie and it is shot beautifully. Yeah. Like it really is. That's you know what, what I'm saying? saying. Like man, please, man. See, you talking about man? You trying to act like me? Like you know what I'm saying? Belly paid in full. Belly. Gotta go. Yeah, belly gotta go. Okay, I agree. Um, I actually am one of the people who have you know a hot take. Uh, I don't think Belly's as good as everybody acts like it is. It's just a cult classic, hood classic. But all it is is, is it's the it's the it's the script from like three different movies yeah. pushed into a movie. Yeah, like no. with Hype Williams doing the. I feel like it should be it's, fucking state property. Goddamn! <laughs> I don't know, man. Payton Fool was done very, very well, though. Very yeah, well. yeah. Well, Payton. Yeah, I like Payton Fool. You know what I'm saying? And a lot of people are doing like like their videos, and you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Taking scenes from Payton Fool. I like that shit. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Why would you? Oh, I'm sorry. It's the same comment. So, is um for the audience, where could they find your music? Uh, y'all can find my music. Honestly, y'all can type my name in and Google. Honestly, Dilo twelve hundred D E L O one two zero zero, or you can go to my uh go to my Instagram Dilo twelve hundred underscore, or you know Spotify, iTunes. Like I'm I'm everywhere. Honestly, you know what I'm saying. If you really wanna, you know what I'm saying. You can really get me everywhere. For, for. And for everybody who is in the local area, he will be performing this Wednesday. Oh yeah! At the Rec Center downtown Fredericksburg on William Street, um, yeah. under Broadway Showcase. It's going to be Broadway's birthday after party afterwards. But he's having a showcase. He has there every week, and he is booked to perform this Wednesday. So everybody, come out see him. I believe the show starts at seven seven thirty. But I will be posting the flyer. As soon as they have the official flyer be, um, come, on the podcast page this week. Um, but it's, it happens down there. The wings are really banging there. They're not like flavored wings like that. They're just regular. I'm trying to tell you, get the breaded wings. They got the yeah. special crystal hot sauce that I requested. They yeah, have it there behind the drinks. bar. And some ranch mix that joint together. It slaps. And the, the uh, drinks are good. So definitely come out. I'm really excited because I've never got to see you perform Man, yet. my, hey, I'll be turned. I am ready to see you perform for sure. Now, I'm telling you, I'll be turned. You know what I'm saying? But it's just to let you know, I don't. After all of my shows, you know what I'm saying? I got, a, I got a family at home. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So I leave. Yep. You know what I'm saying? I, I get straight up out of there. Actually, you know that's really smart. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I get up out yeah. of there. So if you want to, you know, chop it up with him, see him, you gotta make sure you come early. Like yeah. he's saying, like he ain't, he ain't forward to hanging yeah. out and all that other stuff after. Or like, y'all can hit my DM too, you know what I'm saying? If it is artists on this joint, you know what I'm saying? I'm crushing all features, you get what I'm saying? Of course, you know what I'm saying? Hit me, you know what I mean? I ain't going, you know what I'm saying? I ain't going to do you trifling or nothing like that, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? But it is a business though, you know what I'm saying? So That's right, I know that's right. Y'all yeah. definitely, definitely, definitely go check out his music because, you know, I'm very particular and I really do fucks with it. So, I am so... Happy that I got to chop it up with you man, when you came you, to the thank podcast. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. You're man. welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're thank welcome. You. you have it though. You're a star. Like thank it's you. on you. So thank you. all you gotta do is keep applying pressure. It's man, on you. Look, man, I'm telling you, man. That's the only thing I gotta do, man. It's 2021. I see everybody that was with me. Mm -hmm. They ain't with me no more. You get what I'm saying? And I have did many things. I have did so many things. You know what I'm saying? Linked up with so many people. Then got so much game. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I hit thing right here with me. You know what I'm saying? But. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to keep going ahead and putting that, you know what I'm saying, put my hands around their necks. You hear what I'm saying? Apply pressure. Nothing but pressure. And we're going to go ahead and close out with his song, Work It. It's work. No, it's, no, no, no. I'm no, sorry. No, it's a no, 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 got, got 10. ten. Got, got ten. 10. Sorry. I love that yeah. song so much. It's yeah. on my mind. I'm you help. see what I'm saying? It's got 10. <laughs> got 10. And y'all look for this streaming on all platforms in two days yeah. as well. So you can listen to it in your car if you need to. Yes, I got y'all. Thank y'all. Make Trust sure you me. like, follow, subscribe, share. Until next week.
boo tam boo rocks and I'm booming that bitch. Got ten bad bitch that be all on my dick. See ten broke niggas keep asking. Got shit. Got ten blame bullets for the cap of that shit. That little ass brick ain't trapping for shit. Used to post in the party all black in this bitch. Fuck these niggas ain't dapping this shit. Your bitch give me hate, bitch crack this bitch. Bitch you can catch me ain't hot like Miami. Dick do dance I'ma dig like a scandal. Shots move weed like this bitch named Maddie. She need a gun hard she's from Bob Sand. That ball throwing plays at the ball play mad. Make all the work move walk Mike Jackson. I pop two purse he he I'm nasty. Pop two purse he he she nasty. Big boo rock singing like broke. Niggas be broke, picking up road jays. My bitch got clutch, your bitch need to take class. I heard you work cut like you sell a fake ass. Blow, blow my own gas, I ain't need tryna pass. Blush, big blush shit, I ain't need tryna ash. No, you can't smoke, so nigga stop pass. Make, make a nigga walk, throw it up, then catch. Ten boo rocks and I'm booming that bitch. Got ten bad bitch that be all on my D. See ten broke niggas keep asking for shit. Got ten blank bullets for the cap on this shit. That little ass brick ain't trapping for shit. Used to post in the party all black in this bitch. Fuck these niggas ain't dapping this shit. Your bitch give me hate, you get cracked in this bitch. Bitch can catch my name high like Miami. Dick, dick, do dance, I'ma dig like it's candy. Shout out to my weed like this bitch named Maddie. She need a gun, haunt you, it's from Bobby Sack. That ball doing plays at the ball play, mad. Make all the work move, walk Mike Jackson. I pop two purse, he he, I'm nasty. She pop two purse, he he, she nasty. Half of these niggas ain't bought what they bought. I got all the gas, how the fuck is a drought? I got all the coin, how the fuck you can count? You know I got problems, but who wouldn't doubt? You know you got sign, they got punched in the mouth. Bitch, I got sign, they got kicked out the house. Don't send me your message, screw shot it for clout. Niggas like that little type from the couch. In the rear, fucking them up. We don't shed tears. We tying them up. Roll his ass right here. Stop gassing them up. Pop his like beer. Tossing them up, new niggas was weird. Now boy, get the fuck. Switch guns like ears. Stop rapping them up. Watch it pop like ears. Keep giving it up. You beat up your peers. Now you wanna act tough. Ten boo rocks and I'm booming that bitch. Got ten bad bitch that be all on my dick. See ten broke niggas keep asking. Got shit. Got ten blank bullets for the cap of that shit. That little ass brick ain't trapping for shit. Used to post in the party all black in this bitch. Fuck these niggas ain't dapping this shit. Your bitch give me head, you get cracked in this bitch. Bitch can catch me ain't hot like Miami. Dick do dance, I'ma dig like a scat. Shout out to my weed like this bitch named Maddie. She need a gun, haunt you, Mr. Bob Sack. That ball throwing plays at the ball play mad. Make all the work move, walk Mike Jackson. I pop two purse, he he, I'm nasty. She pop two purse, he he, she nasty, 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 nasty. Pop two birds, he he she nasty, 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 nasty,